Hi guys, Spink here. This is episode four of Let's Play Kerbal Space Program Harder Core. Um, when last we left off, we had just got enough science for the science tech, uh, whatever you call this. So we're going to be getting these new parts in 11 days. I did get a uh, an upgrade point when I when I did that so I'm gonna actually expend that in the R&D to speed that up and then that should speed us up to five days let's see if there's any yeah let's see if there's any of these that we need to get next altitude records still can't mm -hmm. get those mm -hmm. until I have manned whatever manned spaceflight uh, test a Rockham X 2477 landed. Well, I can certainly do that. That's eight science. That's a that's a lot of science for me right now. Um, create the Kerbin. This is from the uh, um, contract pack for uh, oh the one that means that I have to have all my satellites connected to each other. That name escapes me at the moment. Mm -hmm. Test this in flight. That's an awful narrow window in the... Uh, so that's probably not doable. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. quite high. Small gear bay in flight. Well, not a great deal that I can do. Duration one year. Is that this guy? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we can do that. All right, so what I'm going to do is uh, warp ahead until our science tech is done, so that I'll have access to those other parts. I did uh, I did some uh, some changing around with the mods a little bit. I got rid of the Kerbal attachment system because it has uh, it has uh, I'm just not using it, and even in even in my last playthrough I didn't use it. So if uh, if something comes up um, as I'm playing through the game and say, wow, it would be great to have that you know if only I had the whatever then I'll, I'll add it back in but right now it's uh, it's not really um, gaining me anything or bringing anything to the party so so I'm gonna leave it leave it as as it is um, test the mark one cockpit landed stack de <sighs> um, okay Tense the escape system in flight that's a, a nice chunk of money, but there's just no way we're getting anywhere near there anytime soon. Oh, gosh. Decoupler mm -hmm. in flight. Guess I'm going to take that and just do the, do the stupid little stuff again for a while until I can build up enough to whatever. Now, I did, uh, I did get a bunch of money off of off of that tundra tundra biome thing and that's why I've actually taken uh, mission controller 2 out is is I could have uh, configured it to uh, to not do those kinds of missions but I, I just didn't didn't bother with it yet I'll, that's another one that I'll probably bring back in at the time because I really like the uh, the satellite repair missions it does um, we're just gonna do a probably another little test stand mission here just simple little boring thing um, that's not optimal. There, it's got to be just so. Um, what do we got here? And then I think I might have to, um, what do I do here? Yeah, okay. Um, Rockamax 2477. Oh, this guy here. Is that going to be a stagium? Activate the part by staging. Test this. Use the run test. This one, toggle him through staging. Okay. I don't think we need any fuel to do that. Um, let's see what else we could possibly do. Um, so I got a bunch of money here. And I thought real... I thought I would just... Um, Use a cheat uh, cheat menu mod, the CIT cheat menu, to remove that uh, that amount of money. 
but I think I'll just leave it in um, because yeah so I will and we will start using up the rest of these use it to uh, actually get some of these science things it is gonna kind of kind of change the whole not the whole but kind of go against what I was trying to do with this but I'm you know s screw it we're just gonna do it but I will use it primarily to uh, to get these uh, to get the new science experiments 15,000 that is a lot all right, we've already done everything with this. We've done everything with this. Um, let's put a antenna on it. I wonder if we can... That's probably good enough. Let's see what we're going to do here. Can we toggle anything on that? We cannot. Magnetometer boom. You know, there's no particular reason to not bring these things along on the off chance that we can get even a even a, you know a token amount of science out of it all right that looks good enough um, 16 days to build this awesome I should check to make sure that my contracts, none of them actually ran out in that amount of time. No, they do not. Okay. So, boy, I sure have stacked the deck against myself pretty powerfully here. This is supposedly what I like to do, though. All right. Um, once we get um, able to launch some significant... Uh, missions here things will things will pick up I think all right so roll him out I probably should have done this at the space plane hangar I don't know if it matters a great deal where is Kerbal alarm clock 91 days we're currently into here um, um let's let's let Jeb Jeb we haven't had a guy come out to the launch pad in some time Got some new buttons down here on this that I don't entirely know what they do. Like this thing. Big map. Oh. It actually shows where my... Where my guy is. What's this do? Export map. Settings. Color. Instrument window. No data. So apparently once I get up in the in orbit, I'm going to be scanning for something or other. This is kind of cool. Wow, whoever did this put a lot of work into it. And it's got us sitting right there. So presumably this is the Space Center. Wow, cool. All right. So first thing we have to do is run a test on this. Yes. We have successfully tested this and got 252 monies out of it. Awesome. Um, hmm. Why do you keep going over there? We want you here. So this one has been completed. This needs to be done through staging. All right, so that has been completed. Yes, yes, I know. Okay. Um, that's it for these. Now we can do whatever science is possible for here. A seismic scan. And we can transmit the whole thing. I don't, I didn't bring any batteries with me, did I? Just whatever batteries this thing has. But we'll just keep that then. Mystery goo observation. Wow, very little. But these things have almost no value when transmitting, so. Isn't there another one of those? Observe the mystery goo. We shall keep that. We're not going to obviously get the full amount out of both of them. Um, might as well keep that. And supposedly an EVA report can be had. All right. Thank <laughs> you. 
Can I do it again? I guess. Not that they're... Ah, no, didn't think so. All right. Well, that was terribly exciting. Nice clouds. All right, so we recover this. Let's see what else we can do. Okay. It's operational service region surface. I think I may have lost whatever I had before for these guys when I re rebuilt. I rebuilt my computer here um, earlier, so so we got a grand total of 15 science. That's better than a kick in the. We covered a great deal of our fundage for obviously since we didn't go anywhere spare parts and we gain oh Jeb gained one experience I don't know had we seen this before had we seen Jeb gain experience or anybody I don't remember so now he can provide stability assist maybe he already had it I don't remember um, well, we did everything before from the, uh, from the space plane hangar, I guess, if that means anything. Test the basic jet engine in flight. Not something I'm going to be able to do. A separatron, obviously, I can do that, and these. So that doesn't really get us a great deal. Now, this is, this is definitely a thing. 20 science and 15,000, 14 and a half thousand funds. But there's just no way we're getting up to this height anytime soon. Mm -hmm. With with what I have, I've really got to. Uh, uh, what I'm probably going to have to do is start looking at space plane stuff, which I totally suck at, and go and and be doing these these kinds of missions. What else do we got down here? Anything? We can add those. Okay. Hmm. Uh, what if we... What if... No, I got some more stuff. What if I just took the opportunity to... Uh, to put these new science experiment, experiments on the doodle bug and do those again? That might be a thing. Since we've already got everything, it won't cost us or uh, won't have much of a build cost or a build um, delay two days because everything here has already been built. Um, hmm. We have new science though. Seismic thingy. This is expensive. 15 I think if I buy this I don't I don't have enough money left for my for this stuff mystery goo containment that cannot actually come back or that can't transmit so I think if I do this and run this guy around put these uh, things back on it's probably something I won't record I'll just um, do that off off offline so because it'll be you know exactly the same as what I did before and probably not uh, not terribly exciting so well, I'll stick one of these on here oh what the heck let's put two of them on let's go go crazier 21,000 if I crash this thing I'm out of luck okay so I am gonna go uh, I guess I'm gonna go drive this around do all of the sites again like I did before <laughs> um, nothing to Nothing to add on to this. Oh, we're over parts already. So I gotta take off some take off some stuff. How about a pair of batteries? There we go. So I'm gonna go um, run this guy. I'll probably uh, uh, cut this part from the video, but we'll see how it goes. So that's so what I'm gonna do. We'll launch this guy. Hmm. 
I don't think I'm limited so much by the money as I am by my uh, by this new tech tree at the moment, really. Um, Jeb just went. Um, how do I add? Oh, there we go. Let's take our scientist with us. Launch, Bob. Doesn't matter. All right, settle down. Oops, shit, shoot, shoot. Brakes. Whoa, just about lost my mind there. Unlock steering. All right, this goes all the way to nothing. All right, brakes, brakes. What can I do here? Seismic scan, transmit. Expand, transmit. I'm gonna do a mystery goo. Keep. Not gonna get much out of this. All right. Brakes are off. Trailer, doesn't it? Nothing wrong with trailers. All right. Oh. Let's run out of gas. Um. Oh no! What just blew up? The engine. Awesome. Well, good thing I kept recording because anytime I screw up, I wanna wanna capture that. Okay, so that was a probably a fairly expensive part, and I just blew it up because I was an idiot. Okay, recover vessel. So we got a grand total of, well, we're up to 29 science. Bob got some, some metals. We got all our parts back with the exception of, yeah, how much was that? Oh, not too bad, just 950, so. But we still ended up do I actually have any active? I don't have any active tastes. We can test the jet engine landed at Kerbin. Definitely do that. Mm -hmm. Test the smaller gear bay. So we'll take that, take that, I guess, and. What if, what if, and we might already have one of these. We have a small, we have three already in use. We have 48, 486,000 parachutes. I'm not sure exactly what that's telling me. Probably a, um, a quantity just due to how it's, how it works probably. We do have an extra reflectron for whatever reason. Oh, I think I stuck two of them on one of them at one point just because of uh, of uh, symmetry. Probe core, Mark One cockpit. Okay, so we got to grab this. 
Um, where'd you go? Utility, right here, the smaller gear bay. Boy, that is kind of smaller, isn't it? What if we took this off and put this one on? That ain't right. I suppose. Durr. That'll put the nose down a little farther than it was. Possibly protecting that engine a little bit. I don't know. This unlock steering. We can do that from the beginning. Well, that's handy. Four days now because we got to build that. Oh, what was I going to do? Um, let's get some of these other parts off that do not, are not apparently contributing. Science. Get rid of this. Um, and then add more batteries. Add more batteries. We can have four more parts, batteries. I could add two more goo containers for uh, a grand total of get another three science out of that. Which is kind of dumb, but it's kind of where I'm at. Let's actually take that off. I was running out of battery power, so I'm going to Put more batteries on this thing. And that puts us at 30. So let me see that I make sure I'm doing this right. Um, run it through staging. Okay, it's fine. Run test on this. Okay, that's fine. So we're good to go on this. We'll launch build the vessel and again I'll probably uh, cut out the uh, the boring part so I screw up again because that's always uh, it's always nice to show that to the world so or the yeah all right so where did I fall off the thing at somewhere over here I think Close, space hangar, launch. Uh, let's see, who did we... We want to bring Bill this time. Launch. If I had the money, I would... Alright, chunk. Alright, brakes. 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 Turn the throttle to off. Let's run the test on this thing. Alright, that's taking care of that. We've got 72. Yeah, out of that. There's that. A little bit more, and we are off to go do whatever it is that we do. Um. Whoa. I think the, uh, that smaller gear bay thing has its collision box not set exactly right. I think that's what it is. Oh, what do we got going here? No, there was something, but there ain't no more. All right, forging ahead. Okay, well, we got a little bit. Actually, we got quite a bit of science now. And Bill got some uh, messages. Messages. Ribbons. Medals. We got uh, 
no no new money just whatever we um oh he gained an experience point bill did all right so what is this 45 additional that we got gonna open up for us i think um i think we need to take oh wow what's this one got oh all kinds of the universal storage stuff a big fuel tank the fairing stuff oh yeah look at all those fuel tanks and nice stuff there stability a lot of good stuff here but i think i need to take this because we've got to get some uh some rockets that, oh, i get a rocket but i don't actually have a fuel tank for it is that what we're saying here all the fuel tanks are down here those are the big fuel tanks and the big parts but up here I don't well I guess I'm gonna get this though that RT 10 that's something I really need liquid fuel engine hmm but I don't have anything better than these little well I'm just gonna to have to make it work I guess so we'll do a research on there so by the time I get to here which is this is what's gonna open up space exploration for us or manned flight right here um, at 90 I have to also have heavy rock you don't need those but I do need to have um, what are these engines those are the normal engines the LT 30 LVT 30 and the T 45 and the normal one here so basically I need to get this for the fuel tanks and this for the engines now I think I can make do and start doing my basic stuff now that you normally start with you know when you're doing this game in a in a non insane mode um, using using these parts so I'm really thinking so far what I'm seeing is uh, I'm not being hampered by the money quite so much um, as the tech tree and that's in large part, I think, because with the hard mode that I'm playing in, the uh, science rewards are very small. And the tech tree is, uh, is very challenging, um, initially, at least from what I'm seeing so far, this uh, KSEA um, tech tree. But I really like it. I like, um, I like the uh, progression that it does from, uh, from weak, underpowered... Um, unmanned rockets you know you you go through a, a period of time before you get up to where you're actually gonna stick a, a Kerbal on the top of one of these things rather than doing that from the very beginning and that seems to make more sense to me as well as um, when we finally are able to do it it will seem like quite a achievement um, considering what all we have to go through to get to it so so I'm liking this so far. What we've got, um, I'm still going to keep an eye on, keep an eye out for other mods that um, can uh, that I see that might add to uh, to what I'm after, what I'm trying to do here. So, um, but I think I'm going to call this episode to a close, and uh, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.